Mastering the SVOC pattern in English sentences. Hello, learners. Today we're going to dive deep into an essential component of English grammar. The subject verb object complement, SVOC, pattern. By the end of this video, you'll be able to understand, identify, and construct sentences using this pattern. So, let's get started. The SVOC pattern is a basic sentence structure in English. It stands for Subject Verb Object Complement. Here, the subject is the doer of the action, the verb is the action, the object is receiving the action, and the complement is information that describes or completes the meaning about the object. Let's take an example. John, subject, painted, verb, the wall, object, red, complement. In this sentence, John is the subject who is doing the action, painted is the action, the wall is the object receiving the action, and red is the complement, giving us more information about the object. Recognizing the SVOC pattern in sentences can be challenging at first, but with practice, it becomes second nature. The key is to identify the subject, who or what the sentence is about, the verb, what action is being performed, the object, who or what is receiving the action, and the complement, additional information about the object. Here's another example. She subject, named, verb, her cat, object, whiskers, complement. Can you see the SVOC pattern here? Now, let's get some practice. I'll give you some sentences, and your job is to identify the SVOC pattern. Ready? 1. My friend bought a new car yesterday. 2. The teacher named the project, Green Energy Revolution. 3. The chef cooked us a delicious meal. Take your time. When you're ready, continue to the next section for the answers. So, how did you do? Let's check. 1. My friend, subject, bought, verb, a new car, object, yesterday, complement, 2. The teacher, subject, named, verb, the project, object, green energy revolution, complement, 3. The chef, subject, cooked, verb, us, indirect object, a delicious meal, direct object. Don't worry if you didn't get them all right, practice makes perfect. Keep trying and you'll get the hang of it. And that wraps up our lesson on the SVOC pattern in English sentences. I hope this video has been helpful and remember, practice is key when learning a new language. Don't be afraid to make mistakes, they're just stepping stones on your path to mastering English. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.